On behalf of CG Tech, Vericut Software, we're here at RE Thompson near Ando. Let's take a look at what they offer to the market. Matthew, we've been invited by Vericup, RE Thompson. Now you have a fast M system, you also have plenty of DMG Mori machines and the Vericup software. How does this all work? Right, the aim uh, has always been, since we put a lot of investment into this business 20 years ago, to run 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 364 days a year. The three things that allow us to do that are the fast ends pallet system, so we can feed lots of jobs into the machines, the effectiveness and the efficiency of the Mori machines, which are built to run 24 hours a day, and the Vericut software, which allows us to test everything in virtual space, in engineering, before we get anywhere near the machines here. Put those three together and you've got a very potent investment that makes it a very efficient manufacturing system. And the type of customers that you serve, what sectors are they in? Mainly aerospace and defence. Um, we've worked in aerospace for over 40 years now. Uh, we've grown as the procurement systems have changed within tier ones, within the OEMs. The investment that we have here means that we can match build rates to some of the OEMs, to the Boeings, to the tier ones, the BAEs and the GEs. They know what they're going to need in 12, 18 months' time, and we match that with the investment that we have here. And this is not just the only facility that you have? No, no. we opened a new factory in Andover in November of 2015. That's now commissioned. We've moved four machines from a previous satellite into the new factory. The factory is approximately four times the floor space that we have here. We've put another three five-axis DNG Morries in, and at the moment, we can still have plenty of room to play tennis or band in one end of the factory while the other end of the factory is working away. So it gives you the opportunity for even more growth? We've got at least another three or four years worth of expansion there before we then start banging our heads on the ceiling again. And at that stage, whether we consolidate the two factories in one big place or whether we look for a third location somewhere, we don't know. But Mike's always pushing forward, our MD is always getting everybody to think clearly about where we're going to be this year, next year, and in five years. And doing it that way means we can look at the investment that we want to make. And how many years have you been working with Vericup? It's coming up to 25 years now. Uh, we started out on a Unix system, um, just doing effectively comparison of customer models to the shapes that we were going to define. We've moved from there over that 25 years. We've evolved as their software has grown. And now you've got four axes, five axis machines doing full machine tool simulation. Every single feature is replicated perfectly so that we know when we push the job down to here, Vericut has made sure that it's going to be absolutely right. Is it possible to look at some of the components now? Of course. That'd be a pleasure. Matthew, can you tell me a little bit more about the benefits of Vericut software? Yeah, there's three major things that make a big difference here. First one is proving jobs on the machine. Before Vericut, we would have proven everything out down on the machine itself, and that can take 10, 12 hours for the type of complex component that you've got here. Nowadays, this and virtually all of our other parts that have any complexity will be run through Vericut, and all of that first off proving and, and looking at how the machine's gonna run and any issues will be done there. So we save time in the setting. The second thing is running fast stems pallet systems we use cubes and tombstones that have got four sides. We need every time we change a component on there to run the whole thing through machine tool simulation. And that way that we can prove when we're moving the pallet around, the job that is in the background somewhere doesn't clash with what's going on on the machine. So again, all of that time is saved and also any downtime from problems with the machine where you get a clash. We run 24 hours a day, seven days a week. If something goes wrong at two in the morning, you lose the machine for hours. So that's the second way. The third way is it allows us to plan the machines to get the most effectiveness from what we do. We check all of the cycle times on here, we review that against the cycle times that we expect, and then we use it to try and optimise every single feature, particularly on the long running jobs that we do for the aerospace primes and people like that. That way we can get the maximum effect. So having invested in Vericut, having invested in DMG Murray expensive machines, having invested in fast step systems, we can run them 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So if you didn't have the automation, if you didn't have Verica, what spindle time would you be left with? 
Well, we aim to do at least 85% uptime, and we get better than that in many instances. I think we lose probably 15 to 20% of that just from having to prove out so much more in the days and have dead machine time when it's not running. We'd also need to set off into the night occasionally without having checked all of the things on a pallet. So our estimate is that it probably increases our uptime between 15 and 20%. So investing in Vericat, it's helped you grow as a business? It's made a massive difference. Um, 25 years ago we were using it in a very limited way, we were using it to check customer verifications. Nowadays nothing, but nothing goes anywhere near any of our machines until it's been fully Vericat and fully machined to the simulator. We couldn't run the business in the way that we do now, as effectively as we do now, without it. Absolutely 100% certain. And what sort of backup do you receive from CG Tech? Very positive. Um, whenever we get a new machine, we need a full machine tool simulation writing. Uh, they're always on hand for that. Their cycle times to deliver that sort of program usually sit very well within the lead times we have for the machine. Um, we've always found them incredibly helpful and incredibly valuable on problem solving. We try and push the boundaries with the parts that we make using five axis machine particularly. And although over 25 years we've developed a lot of expertise here, you still need that absolute expertise that says we've got a problem and we need it solving. And occasionally we need it solving on a Friday afternoon because we're going to run 48 hours of the weekend that we need to have the machine going. And for that sort of backup, they are absolutely first rate. Well, Matthew, it's been great to, to see what you do here. Without uh, many things downstairs, you wouldn't be as successful as you are. It's been a real pleasure. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much indeed.